So recently, Tame and Paula released a video on YouTube of Kevin doing this acoustic version of the song On Track, which is from their newest album. Now, I am already mesmerized by Kevin's beautiful voice, but what I also noticed is that the man has style. So I was inspired to create this video. I will be showing you guys different outfits inspired by Kevin. I have a few photos and videos that I will be taking inspiration from and then I will try to recreate the outfits for my own thrifted wardrobe. So first off, let's start our transformation into Kevin's signature look. So step one, won't be needing these for this video. Don't worry, I can see without my glasses. All right, step two, time to let our hair down and give it some waves, then pushing my bangs out of the way so then I get that middle part that Kevin rocks. And last, the most important step, aesthetic lighting. Now we've got that Tame Impala aesthetic going. Let's create some looks. So as I mentioned, I was inspired by the On Track acoustic video. I really liked what Kevin was wearing. Just a really cool like all black kind of look. He wears a black relaxed looking long sleeve top, some fitted black pants, and some black boots. I feel like this kind of all black outfit can just make anyone look cool. So he just really rocks this outfit. So here is my recreation of his all black outfit. I like the look of a relaxed, loose top with some tight bottoms, so I went for a thrifted black sweater that just fits me on the more loose, baggy side. I did a little tuck into my pants. My pants are American Apparel Disco Pants. They have the perfect like skin-tight fit, which is just like the pants that he's wearing in the video. To finish off the look, I went for these vintage black boots. I think the boots really just elevate the outfit, and I mean not just physically, but just by making it all look put together and just giving it a really stylish look. So for the next look, I was inspired by what Kevin was wearing in the music video for Lost in Yesterday. It has this 70s vibe going on, which I love. I was specifically drawn to this outfit that he's wearing. He has this yellow turtleneck with a necklace and then some really groovy striped pants with a white belt. And here is my version of the outfit. I am wearing a thrifted yellow turtleneck and I paired it with this thrifted necklace that I felt really went with that flashy, gaudy 70s theme that we have going on. Now, I don't own a white belt, so this is the closest thing I had, and it's this beaded black and white one. For my pants, I have these colorful striped vintage jeans that have a kind of 70s silhouette, since the bottoms have a more wider leg. And I'm wearing the same black boots again, just because I think they also go with this style. So for our next look, I wanted to recreate one of Kevin's just common looks that I've seen in a few photos of him. He has this striped t-shirt and some black jeans paired with white sneakers. He also likes to wear this denim jacket in some of his looks as well. I was really excited to create this look because I had the perfect striped t-shirt. Also this look is just so wearable and something that anyone could recreate themselves. So my t-shirt is a thrifted striped shirt that had the perfect look that matched the one that he has. And although I do own a denim jacket, it fits on the larger side for me, so it wasn't giving me the shape that I wanted. So instead, I went for this corduroy button-up. My jeans are some high-waisted vintage black jeans. I put on some white socks and sneakers, and then bam, we have one of Kevin's signature looks. Another common theme for Kevin's typical style is a funky patterned button-up. I've seen him rock a few of these in quite a few photos. I love me a good statement button-up shirt, and I've got quite a collection of my own from the years of thrifting, so I was excited to put a look together. So here is the look that I pulled together. 
I have this funky 60s inspired button up shirt that I feel would be something that Kevin would definitely like. Now he likes to keep things more relaxed so I have this shirt untucked but I also thought to give it a kind of half tuck just to make it look a bit more fitted to my taste. My pants are these thrifted velvet pants that flare at the bottom. I know Kevin will wear more fitted skinny pants, but I wanted to give a more 60s, 70s kind of look for this outfit. He likes to incorporate those elements into his style. Now another thing I see in some of Kevin's looks is a pair of loafers or some nice dress shoes. So I opted for these vintage T-strap Mary Jane heels that have a 60s feel to them. Okay, so now for the really fun part. I'm going to be recreating looks from specific photographs that I found and was inspired by. I came across this photo, which is from an interview article on the Sniffers website. I love how simple this look is, yet somehow Kevin just manages to make it look so cool. I don't know how the man does it. So he has this purple t-shirt and some relaxed kind of wide leg jeans. Okay, so for my look, I know my shirt is not the exact shade of purple, but really any kind of solid color t-shirt can work for this look. My jeans are these Urban Outfitters wide leg jeans that just have the perfect shape that I was looking for. I tried to recreate the photo by cutting out my body and putting it over a blue background. So I also came across this photo that I loved and was also inspired by. He's wearing a white button-up cardigan with some black pants and also these square sunglasses. I just really enjoyed the lighting and the whole aesthetic of this picture and he just looks so cool and so stylish. So here is my recreation of the look. I actually don't own a white cardigan, so I went for this button-up shirt instead. Which works out because he also wears button-ups a lot anyway. I put on the same velvet black pants and although you can't really see his shoes in the photo, I just went for my black boots that I thought went with the look. And of course, we have the sunglasses. I am wearing these square sunglasses that are thrifted from Goodwill. They really just complete the look. As you can see, I've got some moody lighting going on and here is my recreation of the photo. Okay, and this is our final look. I won't be recreating the photo exactly, but I did want to just try out this outfit. I also found this photo of Kevin and I really liked what he was wearing. He has a white sweater with a graphic on it, some white baggy pants, and some sneakers. And this is my recreation of the outfit. I'm wearing this thrifted Yosemite sweatshirt I thought was perfect for this look. My pants are some vintage all white trousers and then I finished off the look with my thrifted white sneakers. I really like how this look turned out. I think there's something just very high fashion and just really cool about wearing a whole all white outfit. And that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I had a lot of fun making this. So you guys tell me, what's your favorite Tame Impala song? Tell me in the comments below. And that's it. Stay positive and always be creative. See you next time. Bye.